my oh. goodness. How are you? Hi there. <laughs> <laughs> debate i'm just delighted it's not the 70s i'm good we're good <laughs> well yeah i should ask for your view on on the 60 days off thing because i suppose as the years go on and then you want to you know, you will come back to work i'm hoping as, as soon as possible you know come back come back tomorrow but um you you'll you'll find school holidays mean that otis has more free time than you <laughs> Just keep the kids at school. That's what it's there for. <laughs> Educate them. Teach them more. Find something else. We always, every day in this show, we find something else that the teachers could be doing. Um, I've just become the most hated woman in Britain, I realise, to both <laughs> teachers and children alike. Uh, so apologies for that. Uh, but yeah, I, that's a that's a problem for uh, the future. Another at the day. moment, I'm just feeling sleepless nights, dirty nappies and breastfeeding. That's all I can deal with. I did hear earlier one of your colleagues said that you'd had the first nappy explosion. I mean, Otis has. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and I believe the new term for it now is punami. It used to just be nappy explosion. Now that's an official thing. Punami is what happens, and it's like a poo tsunami when it just goes over the nappy, oh. <laughs> through the vest, through the whatever he's wearing, into the sleeping bag, and onto the bed. Oh. I mean, it is just, it is Disgusting. That's hours of cleaning up. You don't realise it's such a tiny little being. His clothes are so small and he causes so much washing. It's about three loads go on a day. <laughs> How is he doing? Oh, he's great. He's absolutely just wonderful. Um, a big bag of joy and sleepless nights. Um, he He's reached his is birth weight which is good which means we don't need to wake him up during the night so last night we got a whole four hours uninterrupted <laughs> which makes me feel sort of bright and breezy this morning and we've had that for three nights running i don't want to jinx it but things are looking good oh brilliant and i gather you've you've been out with him for the first time he's had, he's had his first bath so we've got all kinds of milestones yeah, we were out the first time. That was quite a milestone just to get everything ready. Because although you kind of know what he needs, there we go. We went to Chiswick House uh, with the dog. Although you know what he needs, inevitably you forget something. Um, and you have to kind of time it so that you're after feeding. You, you fed him, barked him, changed him. Then you're straight out the door. So somebody has to be packing the bags and getting the car ready. Um, and even though you think you've got the car seat sorted, you don't. It takes you about 20 minutes to figure that one out again every time you come back to it. Uh, but the most special moment we've had is bath time. Oh, Jeremy, I don't know if you remember bathing your wee girls. Oh, it's yeah. just the best. Oh, this oh. is bath time. And he oh, loved I it. Oh, Absolutely I loved it. Jeremy, can I ask a question? Please, do how, look at how this. Is, I think how is your most adored dog now that he's she's no longer number one? Oh, it's interesting actually. When she first, when Otis first came in, she was really curious, um, and she was doing oh. a lot of sniffing. And now every time Otis cries, he sits. She sorry sits next to him, and uh, and tries to lick his feet. We try to stop the licking, but we also don't want to it uh, frighten her or make her think that she's not allowed to interact with him. Huh. So it's a it's a balancing act. But she's being really really good about it. I remember that thing where your 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 baby our, our babies did that thing where their their arms sort of shiver. But what, yeah. there's a word for it, isn't it? Where some sort of reflex that <laughs> you, the oh. Moro, oh, it's the morrow <laughs> reflex. Yeah, it's really really interesting. Yeah, it's hilarious. We didn't know what it was at the beginning. We thought he was just getting a bit of an attitude on him. But I think it's any time they feel like they're falling, maybe they're having a falling dream, or you're holding them in a way that they're uncomfortable. They sort of do this flailing arm movement thing, which just looks like a, a dance, I think. How is Care just... getting on? Fine. He's currently catching up in sleep because after the four hours, he was the one that did the wake up. And I believe he was up for about two hours with them. So although we got four hours solid, I think the next bit was quite difficult. Fortunately, he took him out of the room. So I, I got a really good sleep last night. He did not. What's the? Press, I'm just going to check on a little. Got a hair and I, a well, of course, of course, yes, you're absolute pro. Hey, listen, I've got a little protocol question, but I'll put it to the panel while you listen to. Which is oh, that I if can I, you, Jeremy. It, say, say again. I've lost sound. Oh, okay. My, well, that's quite handy because I want your advice. <laughs> can, am I allowed to just invite myself round? 
No. To new mum? No. If you, I guess, How do just I turn it? up I, with I, some food. Yeah, like, leave it on the door say, turn go away. Food. Bring something turn with you. Up. Maybe some food, with food. And not just food for that day. Maybe like, you know. Um, no, I think a, a basket. I don't know. Containers of food she can put in the freezer. Don't take flowers. I think Storm has lost sound. I think I think she can't. Oh, oh you, you yeah. got well, me you now. Know, yeah. Somebody I, just do, said, don't take flowers. I know flowers all over my house. I was sick of it. Bring I needed food. food. Yeah. I needed someone to have made my food and had it ready so I could eat it. No one did that. You're so right. Yeah. If anyone, ha okay. if you know anyone so right. that has a so baby, Jeremy go bring, around with food. Yeah, bring food in Tupperware containers that yes. they can just put in the freezer, and then when they want, to, when it. they're hungry, they can just warm I up. I love in the microwave. it. Yeah. All right, well we might, yeah, we'll think about that. I don't want to even get you into any social moments. I can see that it's still all hands on deck, right? Oh my goodness, yeah, it is a full time job, one hundred percent. I don't see it easing up either. <laughs> I believe newborn stage is probably the easiest. It just gets harder from and, here. So I'm and Storm, myself. the baby's got a dummy already. So you've gone down the dummy route already. Controversial. Oh, well, are we not? Are we not? What well, is it controversial? I the believe the dummy is supposed to go after six months. But um, yeah, he was just, the problem was he wanted more food. I just fed him before the show. He wants more food. So I kind of popped okay. that into co <laughs> corn him. God <laughs> that bad You just God's have to do whatever oh, works. Listen, best. Do what works. Yeah, yeah. And Why lots of love to you and to care and to Otis.